I hope you all are doing well. Just wanted to talk about a couple things today. Uh, one of them is what I've been going through. Um, I had spoken on this last time um, that once we start to reorder through our light field, um, it's it's taking a little bit of a different understanding um, and adjustment through the perception field. So through the mind and the way that we process through the human, um, there's a lot of things that I'm finding I need to adjust. Um, and every time I go in, it's it's really about tweaking um, through this new mind model um, and through the heart and all these um, things we start to see even through the body, how the body, of course, is a reflection of the energy field, right? So we start to tune into the body where we start to feel these um, differentials or these still these dissonant energies uh, within us as we attempt to navigate the world as a light being. Um, and it's proving to be a little bit more challenging than I had expected. It's really having to take everything from the past and rewrite and reorder through that at a very physical level, at a very mental level as well. Um, so it's been a little bit exhausting um, to be doing that, you know, also, but it's like we're doing this, it's a two part process as we continue to build and grow through the light, always eternally expanding, right? Um, this need to reorder from the outside in as well through the lived expression. So continuing to expand through the lived expression of the physical form of being through the human and all the ways that not only that we're rewriting, but we're also progressing through the human as well. So there's so many layers and levels of things that are occurring right now. Um, you know, we speak of being this multi-dimensional being, and it's really so true. And what's kind of happening now is it's all feeling like it's converging. So there's so many places that our attention is being drawn to and called to. Um, it's really not a matter of, is it energetic or is it physical anymore? It's everything in between that we're adjusting and coordinating to line up, right? Uh, with our, our blueprint and our essence of being. So, um, it's exciting, but it's a little bit, um, it can be a little bit overwhelming um, for the mind to kind of try to process all these things. And of course, right, every time we try, try to process through the mind, we find we start to split out a little bit. So it's, again, remembering to come internal and to reorder from within um, through source, of course. So um, one of the other things I'm finding, too, um, I've always wanted to do you know, with these videos where I am just talking, I've always wanted to do um, a component of the healing work and a component of the energy work with that. Um, but I've just never felt that that worked properly. Every time I would try to do it, it just never seemed to coordinate and fit. Um, and so I'm finding that even through this platform, it's a little bit, um, the energies just aren't fitting anymore for me. Um, so, and I've been running a lot of my attunements and all these other things through my website, which feels more appropriate to me as far as the energy is concerned. Um, and I think part of this too is as we talk about becoming an autonomous being and running our own field, it's also about pulling off of some of these other platforms too. And so to have everything, you know, coming into one central point for me into my website and to continue to um, project the energies out from there um, feels very much in alignment and feels very appropriate for me. So um, rather than trying to do videos on YouTube, I'm going to be doing a weekly call um, where I do discuss the energies and what's going on, but also involving um, the healing component too. So through the, um, the resonant chambers and the angelic harmonies and all these energies that we can start to um, use to assist, further assist our alignments um, in conjunction with the deeper understandings of the energy field. So. Um, if you feel to check that out, of course, everything can be found on my website now, all the attunements, um, uh, the twin flame attunements, as well as the deeper shares um, that I'm doing through the fields. Um, and then also, you know, the individual light language sessions and recordings also. So if you feel to check that out, um, but I will be doing Thursday evenings, um, a weekly call where I do kind of do what I do here, you know, is to discuss energies and what's currently going on, but also um, with deeper work involved. So if you feel um, that that's something that resonates with you, you can check that out as well. So um, just a quick video, you know, to say hi. And, um, you know, we're continuing to move forward. There is so much that's coming in now. Um, um, 
in terms of it, really what's happening, okay, I thought I was going to end this, but really what's happening and what I'm really feeling into is to continue to build this architecture of work-life mission. Um, and, you know, of course, in the past, and I've said this so many times, it's not about going off to the mountain anymore and, and living in a cave and meditating. Um, it really is about how we bring this light into the world in a very functional way, in a fundamental way as well. So uh, we continue to progress the architecture and how we will do this and how we tune into these energies. You know, what does it really look like when mission comes in and how we... Um, extract what we need through the energies to bring this through through our lived expression as a human being right so um it's you know it, energy is all fine and wonderful but if we're not bringing it through our lived form um it's it's pretty useless to what our mission is here and of course you know we're always affecting the world um you know the unseen energetics, of course, are always running, right? And that that's just part of who we are. And that's the way that this whole thing has been built and designed. Um, and yet there is more that we can accomplish and more that we can do um, through tuning our, our physical life forms um, to the energies. So um, that's what I'm continuing to, to move forward with and what I'm continuing to, to work on um, within my own work as well. So Okay, I hope you all are having a wonderful weekend. Um, take good care and we'll talk soon.